Hi, I'm Deborah Thomas. And I'm Dr. Bob Kenavan of the Avalon Clinic. And Deborah was telling me that uh, uh, Dancing with the Stars is really good this time. It is. It's a great season. Um, we have some really great stars on, or celebrities, I should say. I heard one I was interested yes. in. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so I think the part of the lineup is we have Kate plus eight. Uh-huh. And we have Buzz Aldrich, who is 80 years old. He's the uh, first man to walk on the moon. And we also have The Bachelor, Jake, is on. Mm -hmm. And then we have Pamela Anderson. And I know Dr. Kenneman's really interested <laughs> now. <laughs> I was. But anyway, I am. Uh, we better get to our topic. Today we're talking about um, the consultation process. So, Deborah, when we, we, we talked about this before. Mm -hmm. What's the main purpose of a consultation? Well, the main purpose for the consultation is really to find out what our patients want is a match with what we offer here at the clinic. And, and and we have ways we do this. Mm -hmm. Would you explain the different ways we do this? Sure. Well, we have three parts to our consultation. Um, the first part is the medical history. Mm -hmm. The second part is really understanding the patient's situation. Mm -hmm. And then the third part is the evaluation and recommendation. Mm -hmm. so, so, Deborah, you said situation. I know what that means. Mm -hmm. You know, you know what that means. Mm -hmm. We live it every day. Mm -hmm. uh, will you tell our viewers what that means? Sure. Um, what it means is understanding the patient story and what is important to them. So it's really why are they doing it and why is it important to have the procedure for them. Okay. And, and then you said we do an evaluation and recommendation. Mm -hmm. What's involved there, Deborah? Sure. Well, the measurement and evaluation, and that's really so the doctor can be clear on the patient's anatomy. Mm -hmm. And then often times we take measurements, for instance, for the breast augmentation, we do take some measurements. And then once the doctor is clear on the anatomy, um, it allows him to tell the patient what is possible. Right, exactly. Um, so what else happens, Deborah? Well, they receive a written price quote. Mm -hmm. um, if it's for breast augmentation, they have a chance to try on the implants. Mm -hmm. um, it kind of gives them a visual idea of what it will look like afterwards. Mm -hmm. And then they also can look at some surgery dates mm -hmm. um, of what's available so they can plan mm -hmm. to schedule. Yeah. It's very nice to be able to think about what mm -hmm. patients go through in a consultation right. like that. And, and then next week, what are we going to cover? Next week, we're going to talk about how you can pay for your procedure. Okay. So stay Great. tuned. Yes.